One of the best ways to get better at anything is to study. But practice is very important too. Study and practice go together. If you practice what you study, you should get better. But how do you study chess? How do you learn things that you can practice? Well, my videos are a starter. They'll definitely get you going. They'll give you a taste of many different tricks you can use in your chess games. One way to explore more is to buy some chess books. So let's go to an online bookshop and look for some chess books. Now here's the problem. There are loads to choose from and most of them will be a complete waste of your time and money. Excellent books for somebody else but not written for children. So let's do a more intelligent search. Now this isn't the only online bookshop, but that's better. We're down to 20 books. On this website, there are a few more to choose from. And here's another website. And maybe you have your own favourite online bookshop. If you're just starting, then you don't want anything too complicated. And these books from Usborne, or these books from Batsford, would be a good list to choose from. And here are another couple of options too for your first chess book. And then, if you've played lots of chess, if you find that you're interested in chess, interested in getting better, then you'll want to get some harder books. These books published by Gambit will definitely stretch you, and you'll need to work through them slowly with a chess set. But these books won't make much sense if you've only just started playing. You need to be quite familiar with chess. These books will show you how to start a game, how to finish a game and how to fight well along the way. And these books by author Charles Hurton are another good choice for any children with good chess potential. Remember, if you're reading one of these harder books, then use a chess set so it's easier to follow what's going on. These kind of books will contain lots of ideas, with lots of examples where the trick has worked in real games. The idea is that you learn the tricks and spot opportunities to use them in your games. The thing is, I've just quickly gone through a list of 15 chess books, without mentioning any puzzle books, and that's going to cost you over £100 if you want all of them. And if you're not that interested in chess, you're going to find the harder books quite boring and you won't want to work through them. So the best plan is to get just one and see how you get on. Or better still, see if any of them are in your school library. And even if you do read the books, you won't get any better unless you practice your new skills. So make sure that you play regularly against friends, family or a computer. By the way, did you spot what was wrong with the chessboard in the picture?